Hey guys, Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter for your mini awesome cast. We're going to get gaming today, so uh, this is for my friends over at InsertCoinToBegin.com as well. But uh, hey, it's my show, damn it. Uh, anyways, Mortal Kombat X was uh, released yesterday on, um, on uh, mobile platforms, iOS in particular. I'm not entirely clear. It looks like iOS only for the moment, uh, but it, it should be coming to Android if it's not there already. So keep checking in for that if you're on that side of things. Uh, I am very excited for this, mostly because uh, when I saw the previews, and uh, we got some footage here from uh, uh, Willscom up there on the YouTubes, and uh, it, it this okay this is basically taking what we've known injustice uh wwe immortals this kind of touch rpg ish fighting game for the phone which i think works really well it fits it it, it, it makes sense and and more than a lot of fighting games i think uh that really trying to emulate what you do on uh on a mobile platform uh but it, it it also adds that you know the 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 crushing abilities and and the look and style of mortal Kombat on top of things i think it really kind of uh the little bit of i played with it here um you know kind of first impressions it's the same thing you're starting with really low level characters the biggest difference is uh, whereas we have WWE Immortals, and you really have multiple versions of the same characters, they don't flush that out a lot, and they are now as they're adding characters and everything. Um, this one has just there's tons of characters in Mortal Kombat, and they're able to spread those around the uh, bronze, silver, and gold levels of characters. And, and, and if you go, it's like it's kind of like a card train game, and you're leveling, leveling things up, but those those cards and those stats are actually applying to the fighters you have in the game. And you see that how you pull off the moves if you're watching on the video. Um, you know, there's, there's there's fatalities, there's all kinds of stuff, um, and uh, it's 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 you know what you would expect. Um, and, and you're able to do do this stuff, um, you know, in in a mobile platform that it really is intuitive. Um, I, I I'm digging on it. It's uh, I I don't know how dedicated I'm going to get to it, like I was with Immortals, because it's like, well, I feels like I'm going to be going through a lot of the same, um, you know, a lot of the same moves again to level things up and get these characters and get gold. And this is a freemium game. You can download this and play it for free. One of the ingenious things I think they're also doing with this is if you dig in here, and they don't have all the modes opened up yet. There's like Raiden Challenge, which I think is going to be like, if you play WWE Immortals, you'd have a Brock Lesnar or Daniel Bryan challenge where you're going through these levels. And, uh, you know, if you beat all five of the tiers of fights, uh, you get like, you know, you get gold and everything in the meantime and some content packs, but, uh, you know, you get a, an awesome gold level character. So uh, I think, uh, you know, as that comes along, there's not even an online online play, quote unquote. You play other characters, but you're not actually playing them directly or other players online. Um, but there are challenges. It looks like they're kind of rolling things out uh, slowly for the features of this game. And Mortal Kombat X doesn't come out to, until the 14th. It was actually released a, a, a week in advance. But the other cool thing in there is, is if you dig in, there's um, a, a console. There's a console connection in there. So they have a WB Interactive uh, login that you can use for this. And you have for Immortals and in, 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 um, uh, Injustice previously. So if I get the game Mortal Kombat X on one of my consoles, now all those, you know, you, you get extra stuff. You do something in the game over there, you'll get extra coins over here. You do something in the mobile version, you'll get some extra stuff over on the on the console game. Ingenious. I love it. You're and, and it's a way to extend that gameplay and it's like, well, I'm doing this on the go, you know, and, and yet it's a different game. And I think that's really cool that they, they're able to tie something that together and, and it's not, you know, making me buy something for five bucks, you know, on my phone on top of things. It really is gonna be kind of an extension experience, it feels like. Um so I think that's really cool. I, the drawbacks, those first level characters that you get, like they gave you three characters that like I've never heard of in Mortal Kombat. One's like Soldier, and you know, it really, really generic bronze level characters to the point where I don't even want to buy. I, I, I'm, I don't really want any more of the low level characters. I'm completely just going for silver and and just not even bothering. I'm sure I'll be awarded some along the way as I as I level up through things. Um, but uh, but no, worthwhile. It's free. Why not check it out? Mortal Kombat X, it's on iOS and should be, if not yet, very soon on Android devices. Looks great. 
by the way. Um, some fun stuff on Unreal Engine. If you like fighting games, you're going to dig this. It takes a little bit getting used to. I didn't get into Injustice at first, um, but I really took my time with it with WWE Immortals, and now I get it. And I actually consider going back to Injustice and seeing how I can do there. So with that, let us know what you think. Comments to this on the blog or uh, uh, comments on the YouTube or hit me up at Sean on the Twitters, at AwesomeCast, and check out all the great shows. Uh, great talk with DJ Lunchbox, our friend from Wrestling Mayhem Show on Panel Ride. Uh, this week on Awesome Cast uh, 243, if I got that number right, uh, this week. Talking about getting off social media. He got off for 30 days, and let's see uh, what his response was to that and what it did for his mental state. Uh, great discussion, about 20 minute discussion we had on that on the sh- main show. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.